Hey guys, happy Tuesday. So, my internet is down. I've tried unplugging the modem and plugging it back in and we got nothing, people. We got nothing. So, anyway, for lunch today, I'm having leftovers from last night. This is brown rice and some chicken that I did in the crock pot. I just had two chicken breasts and put them in the crock pot with some water and some onion soup mix and this is and then I also roasted some butternut squash and green beans so here's the leftovers and here's a beggar it's turned out really good It's so good with the squash mixed in. I'm going to make this chicken all the time and just have it in the fridge. It's delicious. So hey everybody, I'm finished eating my lunch and the internet is still down. It's 2.15. It's been down ever since like 12.30. I don't know. Um, so today I have to go to Office Max or I mean Office Depot or um, not Office Depot. Um, anyway, one of those places. I need to get a new one of these. Let me tell you what happened. This has happened twice and the second time blew this out. So, I try to keep my charging cord off the floor, but sometimes it just, I just leave it on the floor, and once I stepped on it with my sock, and I shocked myself, I was like, ah! If you have your, the little tip of your charger on the carpet, and then you step on it with, your, with a sock, or anything like that, you might get shocked, and I did. And it was a pretty big shock. But my phone charger and everything kept working. Well, last night it was on the floor and I stepped on it. And it was just a little shock, but I thought I stepped on a sticker. And I stepped. I had stepped on my charging cord and shocked my foot. So I went to charge my phone last night using this and it didn't work. My phone wasn't charging and so I didn't know if it was my cord or this thing and so I had an extra one of these and so I switched it out and my phone started charging so sure enough this shorted out or broke or fried out or something so I have to go get a new one just because I want to have a spare and I also need a new charging cord because I have a new one that came with this cell phone that I'm using but my old one at the base, all the rubbers come off and all the wires are showing and that's a fire hazard. And so I want to get a new one because I just like to have a spare charging cord to keep in my purse. So anyway, we're going to go get one of those and then I have to go to Walmart because I, the cats need food. Holy crap. The cats need food. Okay, they've got plenty. But, um... So I need to get him food, and I need, Daryl wants milk duds, <laughs> and I don't know, I, I wrote down some things, so anyway, that's what we're doing. So, I'm also going to go to Down East Clothing and take back a shirt, and I have some things from the Dollar Tree that if I go to the Dollar Tree today, I'm going to take back. I have two picture frames and a rubber sink stopper or a, a, that silicone sink strainer thing. I should have just put both of them in here. I think I'm going to like the little metal one the best. But we shall see, shall. I need to adjust this. It looks different for some reason. There we go. I don't know. Okay, that's what I was trying to think of. So we're here at the Best Buy. 
and I'm gonna try to find the Best Buy. All right, I'm already back. And the nice young man immediately helped me. He was so sweet. I would have completely went to the wrong end of the store because last time I looked for something like this, it was at a completely different area. So I got my USB adapter and this was, I think, $23. Oh, $21.99. And then I got my USB cable. And that was $11.99. So I spent $36.31, y'all. $36.31, y'all. As Tyler would say, bless it. <laughs> Love you, Tyler. So... Now we're gonna go and exchange a shirt. Well, I'm not gonna exchange it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just take it back. It's this one. Making sure there's no weird guys around. It's cute and all, but I just don't need it. And this one's just a tad, just a tad tight around the titties. <laughs> so I'm taking it back and so I will get back, I think it was $34.99 for this stupid shirt. So anywho, that's where we're going to go now. Okay, y'all. I just got out of there and they got new stuff in and she's all, do you want to look around? I'm like, uh. I was just in there like a week ago, week and a half ago, and they've already got new stuff. So I'm all, okay. And I tried on this really cute black and white checkered shirt, but it just, the top, the top of it just didn't look right. It was weird. So I didn't buy anything and I got $37 back. That's just the best. So now I'm trying to debate if I want to go to the Dollar Tree and take back a few things. <sighs> I just don't know. Probably not. I think I'll just go to the store. You know what I mean? Humbada, 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 humbada. Oh, that's right. I'm not going to the grocery store. I'm going to the Walmart. So that'll be fun. That will be fun. I should go to the Walmart that's just like right here. But I hate that Walmart. It's so crowded. The parking lot is ridiculous. So I'm going to go to a different one that's like way far away. Just to save my sanity. Tell Tony he needs to get this. It's a Chewbacca Star Wars animal. to the pool. I'd want to be floating on a big gold piece of poo. Glory, here's your poodoo. That's cute, but your poodoo's cuter. Look at these super cute cases, you guys. And can you believe my phone used to be this small? <laughs> totally had to turn around and go the opposite way because there's a sales lady standing right there and she was staring at me getting ready to pitch me and I, was, I just turned right around and walked a different direction. I hate that. It's so uncomfortable. Alrighty, we're on our way home. So after Walmart, I went to my grocery store because I wanted to get another one of those yogurt parfaits. 
that I bought last week and it had blueberries in it. Best parfait I'd ever had in my flipping life. And they didn't have any today. They had two that were pomegranate. And I just didn't want to chance it because they were five dollars a piece. So I'm so bummed because I was so craving one of those. So maybe I'll try tomorrow. I'm sure they make them daily. I just hope they keep selling them. I hope they don't get rid of them because they're not selling enough or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, I'm going home now. It's 4.30. Um, it took me forever to get out of Walmart because I stood in line behind somebody. Well, there was somebody buying all these flowers, like tulips and things that needed to be planted and groceries. And then there were two other people to go and then it was me and it was taking forever. So I went to the next line and sure enough, I would have, I should have just stayed in the first line because I would have been out of there sooner. I always do that. That happens to me all the time. I get in the poopy lane or the poopy aisle checkout stand and so I move and I get into another poopy aisle. So, anywho. I'm on the way home and it is 57 degrees and it feels so good. It's kind of cloudy though, like overcast, so the sun's not shining, but it just feels so good. And I don't know what I'm going to do about dinner tonight. I'm not even hungry. That brown rice and chicken filled me up. So, I know Daryl went out to lunch today, like he does every day. So, I'm hoping he's not very hungry, and then he can have a salad, and then I can have a salad and call it good. Because I just don't want Daryl to get bored of salads, because that's what I'm eating a lot of now, for right now, is salads. But, whatever. Just whatever. Okay. Alright, I'm home. Let me show you what I got at the Walmart. I got a bath mat. Um, these are 288 and when they start getting slimy, I just throw them away. So, yep, got one of those. I, I love them. Got me some ultra strength gas X. Not extra strength, but ultra strength. I needed some more OxyClean Stain Fighter. They used to have one in a little spray bottle, but all I could find at this Walmart was a stick. And look, it's got stain grabbing nubs. So yeah. Um, Daryl needed some more B6. And oh yes, I found my L'Oreal True Match blush in Baby Blossom. This was actually behind another color. The Baby Blossom section was all gone. And I happened to pick up another color that I thought I might like, and right behind it was this. So I was so excited. I found Daryl's Milk Duds, so I got him a couple of boxes of those. And then, I really like this fruit medley stuff. It's got apricots, cherries, blueberries, and strawberries. So I went ahead and grabbed one of these. If it's really fresh, they'll be soft. If it's not, they'll be hard. But they don't expire until December, so I'm hoping I got a fairly fresh batch. And then I got this. I just had to. It's for your iPhone and it's clear. This is just a gold paper that they have behind it. But I just wanted something different for my phone. And I know it's probably not the greatest case, but I got it anyway. It's just so cute and so springy. And so I just got it. And then I got two of these tank tops. They're polyester and this is what I've been looking for. I got a black one and a white one. And they're rather big, so this is a small, and it's quite big. And I like that it's flowy and wider at the bottom. It's not fitting, and so 
I can wear my sweaters, like my cardigans over these, and it, it won't show my pooch because they're baggy. So, and these are like 6 40 or something like that for each one. So, anyway, that's what I got. Oh, and a bag of cat food. That's what I got at the Walmart. Wow. Say yes. There you go. Yeah. Oh, bye. Oh, you love it out here, huh? Nice. Oh, look at you. Look at you. Oh, I love you. Hi. Do you want a treat? Come get your treaty. Get your treaty. Yeah, lick up the breath. Yeah. Look at how happy she is. Oh, you're so cute. You're so cute. Look at that tail. She is so darn cute. I love you. I'm giving her one of the broth treats so that she can lick it up. Open these treats and they are good. They're nice and soft. So let's try a big one. This is a strawberry. Mm. These are so good. So here's my old cord, you guys. Look at how bad that is. And yeah, it still charges and everything, but, and it's cracked right there, but yeah, it's a fire hazard. Um, it can start smoking and set a fire, that's what I heard, so. I'm not about to chance that, so this is going bye-bye. Here's my bag that I got from the Dollar Tree. I keep it in my purse. It's the strawberry one, and I use it all the time. When I go to my mailbox, I always have a crap ton of mail, and I just pull this out of my purse and put all my mail in it. It's the best. And then you just scrunch it all in. I have a banana one in my car. So, yep. Pretty awesome. Anyway, there it is. It's my dingleberry. So for dinner tonight, we're having a salad and I'm using, I'm cooking this Texas toast from the Dollar Tree. And so hopefully this will be done soon. I'm being a good girl and I'm not having any toast. I'm having a banana and a little little salad. Daryl and I have confirmed that these Texas toasts from the Dollar Tree are super, super good. They're really crispy and, and yummy. <laughs> I don't know about super, super good, but... They are super, super good.
Anyone? Anyone? Whatever. Hey everybody, welcome to the closet. Uh, Momo didn't come. She must be upstairs with Daryl. He's working on the computer. She'll be in soon though, I'm sure. You'll be so proud of me. I know I'm proud of me. I did the treadmill for two miles, 2.1 miles. And it took about 35 minutes, but I was faster than normal. And I only burned 300 calories. <laughs> So, the, I think that burned off the thin mints. Anyway, I dreaded going down there. I dreaded it. I dreaded it. But I just forced myself, and I'm so glad. I always feel better after I'm done. It's just getting down there. It's just the start of it, you know? It's fine when you're doing it and when you're done, but before you get there, it's like, oh my gosh. It's like, just put your sweats on and go down there and do it. Ugh. I have my new cell phone cover on my phone and it is amazing. It is so much lighter than my other one. The other one made my phone so heavy. And I know this is a cheapo $6 case and it's not going to protect my phone very well, but I don't really drop my phone. Knock on wood. Knock on wood. So I'm hoping this will work for a while, but I love it. It's darling, and my phone is lighter, and I can take the cover on and off easily. So, like, when I have to take it off to put it in my um, tripod, but you know what? This might actually fit in my tripod now. I might not even need to take it off. Oh my gosh. Awesome. So. Ugh. I have like a cramp. So here are the tank tops that I got at the Walmart. They so the bottoms are kind of, you know, scooped. I just love them. They smell Every time I get stuff at Walmart, it smells like McDonald's. Because you know, they've been basking in the McDonald's smell all day every day because there's a McDonald's there. But anyway, so these were $6.44. And I just love them. So I'm gonna wash those. And, um, I really don't have anything left over there to show you. We've conquered all of my closet junk, except for that. But that warrants a whole video in itself. Yeah, that's just... I don't even want to go there right now. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go because my cousin is texting me and so I need to get back to her. But I just love ya and I hope you had a great day and I'm hoping that my internet will stop freaking out, which is why I'm so late on uploading my videos. My internet has just been going in and out. Oh, anyway. So I hope to see you soon, and I'll just love you. Have a nice sleepy. I will see you later. Good night, everybody.